Welcome collectors to Ultimate Victory. This is the first pay-per-view of Laugh Season 2. And we're going to be breaking something, of course. We are breaking open a box of WWE Royal Rumble. Now, this is a Fleer release back in 2002. And uh, shout out to Victor Negron, who said that there were some uh, cards in here. And he was correct. Uh, John Cena's rookie is going to be the key card that we're looking for. And also, this was kind of uh, Brock Lesnar's first year. Uh, so those are the big cards that we're looking for. Uh, there's also some inserts. We have Divalicious, gimmick matches, factions, and then the event used memorabilia cards 1 through 12. We should have two of those. So again, um, when we before we did this, I asked you to pick a number 1 through 24. We are going to rip open these packs, mix them up, and see what numbered packs have the hits, which are going to be those insert cards. And here you go. So we have a 90-card base set. 75 Royal Rumble cards, 15 AKA cards, and then all those other different ones. So very cool right there. And maybe we can get uh, an autograph if the autographs were live. Because if you remember, I hit some stuff before in the past that you had to send in. They were redemptions, unfortunately. So packs look pretty good in terms of the look of them. We'll take a look at that after we're done. All right. I know that there were some wrestling fans that wanted this set because it has the uh, the John Cena um, rookie card in it. We'll just mix these packs up here. So hopefully we'll get uh, at least two. Then maybe uh, we can do some type of giveaway with the John Cena at a future date. But uh, all right, those are the 24 packs. And this is pack number one. So good luck, everybody. Hopefully the cards aren't going to stick together either. Because again, this is 2002. And let's see what we got. All right, so here is the base card, Hurricane. There's the back of that. And I don't know if you can tell this, so it looks like the, the logo is embossed right there, uh, along with the FLIR symbol. So there is some embossment to it. Can feel it's kind of raised even the name down there is also raised so there's the base card here is an aka rvd so that's the the other base card to the set we got ray mysterio chris nowinski who had to uh bow out early because of concussions and then he started uh foundations to uh, to oh there's the brock lesnar rookie card right up there so that's the rookie and well, I because it says after the 2002 Rumble, so that's why I'm kind of thinking that this is a rookie card, but we'll have to take a look at that. We got a Paul Heyman, and then we got like a, a gold version of Latino Heat, Eddie Guerrero, right there. So there we go. And then part of this is, I guess, the checklist. So I, this is just an insert. So nothing in pack one. I don't think anybody chose pack one in the contest. I don't know, I don't think anybody chose a lot in the 20s, in the late 20s. If, uh, I'm on it, perfectly honest remembering this stuff, so we'll have to see. We got Chris Jericho with the lion salt right there. There's Chuck. Tommy Dreamer. Taz, so he was an announcer back then. We got Rikishi. Maven, if you remember, his biggest thing was taking out uh, The Undertaker at the Rumble. And then an AKA career killer already, Brock Lesnar right there. It's kind of cool. It's pack two, pack three. All right, so here's Sean Shaziak, Stasiak. Christian, who was asked if he would come back, but he really, um, health-wise, I don't think he could, could really ever come back um, from what happened to him. Here's a ladder match. This has to be one of the inserts. This is gimmick matches. There you go, GM3. So ladder match, it, I guess ladder matches were gig matches back then in 2002, uh, RVD versus Latino Heat. We got a Rico, who's with Chuck and Billy. Got a nice AKA Undertaker, beautiful. Right behind it, another AKA, The Game, Jacqueline and Big Show. To round out pack three, pack four. Kind of like the older products. You get to, uh, I mean, this was 
when I was definitely watching it, um, Victoria, each week, RVD, a.k.a., we got a devastating Don Marie. Yeah, and these are sticking a little bit here. There we go. There's the back of that. So that's another one of those inserts. Chris Nowinski again. So we're already getting doubles, which is good. Nydia and the collation stays the same. Brock Lesnar followed by Paul Heyman, which is uh, ironic, I guess. Uh, Latino Heat. So nothing in pack four. On to pack five. Uh, I even, uh, I would record Raws back in the day uh, for maybe about a two-year stretch, and then I would actually uh, go back and write what happened in the matches and put that with the with the video uh, tape. So that's how much I was a fan of back in the day. There is Tajiri Nice with the mist. D'Lo Brown without the armor. So he was okay back in 2002. We got Funaki, number one. Raven. RVD with the frog splash. We got an HBK. And Terry. All right, on to pack six. All right, there's Jackie. Eric Bischoff. We got gender match, okay, gimmick match. The Rock and Trish Stratus. Again, these some of these cards are sticking right there in the middle. There you go. There's the back of that. Shawn Michaels. Uh, I think that was the lighter match. Was it? That might have been at SummerSlam with uh, Triple H. Undertaker. Nice. Bradshaw. Chris Benoit. And Team Extreme right there. So they put all of the Team Ex Extreme together. We got Spike Dudley. And in lucky number seven, we have a hit. We have an Edge event used ring mat. So seven is going to be the winner. There you go, right there. Nice that it is in the pack. I th I'm fairly certain that a, a, a bunch of people pick seven. There's The Rock, Stacy Keebler, Jazz, Molly, and then Tori Wilson. I'm sure that was a Braun Panties match right there. All right, so lucky number seven gets it. All right, on to eight. So I think we're going to have a bunch of people with grand prize entries, which is a good thing. Still haven't pulled the Cena rookie. Hopefully we'll get that. Sean Stasek, I don't know because we've seen him before on the top, but we haven't seen Lita. There you go. And a nice uh, ladder match of Undertaker versus Jeff Hardy. It's got that gold right there. That's kind of cool. There you go. Rico, and we got some more AKAs, Big Evil, Red Devil, and The Game. We got a Jacqueline and Big Show, so that collation is the same. Nothing in pack eight, on to nine. Hurricane, Eddie Guerrero, there we go. Deacon Batista. He was with uh, Devon. Hollywood Hulk Hogan. I, I remember seeing a relic that has this, so that's the same picture, I think, as one of his shirt relics. Bubba Ray Dudley. Jerry the King Lawler. We have Trish Stratus and Ric Flair, who's getting ready to woo, or post-woo. Pack 10. Got an AKA gold medalist right on top. Mark Henry. We got Christian. Ah, oh, that's a very cool looking cane card with the explosion. That is sweet. That is nice. That's going in the PC. Farouk, William Regal, right there. Wonder if he had knuckles in the in the uh, the, the pants. Shane McMahon and Triple H. Wonder if that's from uh, Shane McMahon and uh, Kurt Angle's iconic match when he was. Put through all those windows in the gl the glass of the uh, on the stage. Test. Chuck. Dilo Brown. Taz Rikishi. We've seen that before. Maybe we've seen this pack. I think Maven. Kurt Angle right there. 
And then career killer, Brock Lesnar. On to pack 12. Nothing in lucky number 11. I'm pretty sure we had some of those in there. All right, we have The Rock. And in pack 12 is going to be our other uh, hit. This is hardcore match, Rod Van Dam versus Jeff Hardy. And this is an event-worn tank top. And I'm assuming it's going to be of Jeff Hardy because it's on the Jeff Hardy side. So that's kind of cool. That's unique. Authentic event-worn tank top by Jeff Hardy. So 12 and 7 right now. Brahma Bull. Stacy Keebler, we got Jazz, Molly, and Tori Wilson. So we're still looking for the John Cena, which is uh, kind of strange, but we did have early hits of the of the relics, so we'll have to see who got those. So congratulations if you know already if you you've won. Uh, Devastating, Stacy Keebler, Jerry the King, Lance Storm. We've got a Jeff Hardy and an Edge and a gold dust. And as you can see with the um, edge, they, they'll use the same picture. They just upped it a little bit. So same picture as the base. So I'm still gonna keep track in case we get extra hits or anything like that, because who knows? Don't remember the boxes in 2002 if there were three hits, could be possibly three hits, but gold medalist. Oh, there we go, the rock, there you go. And Mark Henry, so new ones. We got a double of that Kane card, very cool. William Regal, Farouk, Triple H, and Shane McMahon. We go 14. Chavo. Jim Ross has a card, there we go. This is the regular card of the RVD hardcore match. Got a Don Marie. Got Billy, this is our first Billy card. Al Snow, Albert, and Devon. When he would uh, give his sermons and do the blessing with the, the hands. Chris Jericho, this looks like a pack we've had before. Tajiri, Rey Mysterio, Funaki. Raven, RVD, HBK, and Terry. On to 16. All right, we got Jackie, Eric Bischoff, Chris Jericho versus Kane in a, unfortunately these are sticking there. There you go, last man standing. Shawn Michaels and Taker, two legends back-to-back. -back. Bradshaw, we have the Rabid Wolverine and Team Extreme. On to 17. Chavo Guerrero. Ivory's going to be a new one. Kurt Angle versus Shane McMahon in the street fight. And they had a nice one there at the pay-per-view. Well, he's going to remember that one. Don Marie. Billy, Al Snow, Albert, and Devon. All right, still waiting on the... On the Cena rookie card here. Chris Benoit. Eddie Guerrero, Deacon Batista, Hollywood Hogan, Bubba Ray, Jerry Lawler, Trish Stratus, Ric Flair, Kevin Nash, that one's new. Stevie Richards. Stephanie. Billy Kidman. Randy Orton. Hardcore Holly. Planet Stasiak and Hollywood Hogan for the AKAs. I would imagine we would we would get a, a full set of cards, but 
I have to see here. There we go. Here's the rookie card. There's the John Cena rookie card right there. So there's the back of that. Looks to be in pretty good condition. I'll have to sleeve that. Ivory. Tommy Dreamer. Good old JR. Nice. X Pac. Of course, Vince McMahon has to have a card. Nature Boy and Booker T. Wow, back to back, nice. Without getting it in the first couple, and now we got two of them. John Cena, rookie card. Very nice. Spike Dudley. Stephanie McMahon, Divatastic. Good old JR. X Pac, Vince McMahon, same collation. Booker T and Nature Boy, so that collation was kind of the same. Chris Benoit, Stephen Richards. It's a Shawn. This is an insert, probably. Royal Rumble, Shawn Michaels. And that is, yeah, it's RRR9. So that's going to be one of the Royal Rumble recaps. These are 1 in 24 right there. So that's kind of cool. I like the font that they used on that one. Billy Kidman, Randy Orton. Scotty Tuhati doing the worm. Right there. Planet Stasiak and Hollywood. And last pack. Kevin Nash. Matt Hardy. Stephanie. Jerry Lawler. Lance Storm. Pardon me for a moment. There you go. Jeff Hardy. Edge and gold dust so that is going to do it for the cards let's find out who the winners are all right so looking at the spreadsheet we have seven winners so seven people right off the bat picked the lucky number so congrats to all of you i'll, I'll tell you who they are um, you automatically get an entry into the grand prize we got to do two randoms here to see who gets the belt so if you win the belt then you go on to defend that title at the next pay-per-view. If no one guesses a number, so let's say there's only one number that's guessed instead of you know two, then you could get a free ride and a free entry just for winning the belt. You get you get you hold on to the belt and win another entry. I believe Gary S might have even won it based on just carrying the belt over from another pay-per-view last year. So, all right. So here are the here's the first random. We have four people. Jason Wento, Rob Tierney, Jesse Starr, and Jess Winder uh, Singh. Uh, Rob Tierney won last year. He was one of the prize winners. And with these randoms, we're just going to do this eight times. Whoever's on top is going to be the belt holder. Um, I like to put in uh, double them up. So everybody has their name twice in here because with the with the randoms that only have like two or three, uh, it's it's nice. I've seen breakers put people's names in there because it's it's better for the randomness. So. There is seven. Whoever's on the top of this one is going to win the belt. So, nice. Jazzwinger Singh, you are one of the belt holders. We'll give you the heavyweight title. So, congratulations to you. You might have a free ride next month. And then the other people that got this in 12 was uh, Frank J. Eddie III, Victor DeGrand Cards, and Outlaw358. So, we're going to random this eight times. Again, who's on top is going to be the belt holder going into next pay-per-view. Seven, and whoever's on top of lucky number eight. Victor DeGran. Okay, so we have Victor DeGran cards winning the Legends belt and uh, Jazz Winger Singh getting the heavyweight. So you guys are going to be the uh, belt holders going into the next one. The next one probably is going to be in uh, late May again. I like to kind of space these out, but congratulations to you. It's great that we have seven people that already had grand prize entries. If you didn't enter this time around, you still have seven more chances this year to get in on the season long, giving away over $500, even $600 worth of prizes. So get in on the next one. I really appreciate you checking out Ultimate Victory. If you like the video, hit that like button below. If you want to be part of the giveaways, you got to hit the sub button below. Feel free to tell me about your hits in the comments. Always love to hear about those. And of course, there's social media, Instagram, at Like a Hawk Cards, all one word. 
Hope you have a lot of luck in your next break, and thanks for watching Like a Hawk.